Hello, it's late at night, but I'm gonna do this video anyway. It's for uh, my friend Scott. Um, he wants to put videos on uh, YouTube with a camera similar to mine. Um, my camera records to uh, motion JPEG, uh, AVI format, and uh, just let me show you what uh, what happens when you do that. Let's say here. Uh, suck at the comparison here. You got an AVI. Okay. That is 122 megabytes. Right? And the same video as a WMV is. 16 megabytes it's a whole lot faster to download and for other people to download and view videos on YouTube if the file is smaller now I'm going to show you how to do that with Windows Movie Maker you uh, make your movie and you put it on your hard drive and all you do is click on the tasks right and you import your video right and then you'll have all the videos that you've made you just choose with the um, the folder there and what video we want and it'll import it and it'll show up in this window and you'll have a drop down menu here I'll show the videos that you've uh, downloaded. Each video will make its own folder and then you can add pictures to it. Right? There's a picture of my kids. Or, you know, still pictures. And all you do is you take a video like this one. Click on it, drag down to here. There you go. There's a video, and it shows up over here too. You can play it. Right? And if you want to add a, another video, you can. And put transitions in, or whatever. But for simplicity's sake, say we've made our video. Uh, delete it. Uh, you've made your video. You've imported it into Windows Movie Maker. You go up to Save to My Computer. And I, you will name your movie here and choose where you want to save it to, right? I put mine in my videos. And then you hit next. And then it will have all different kinds of um, formats for, um, for saving. The more megabits per second, the bigger the file will be. I just use high quality videos small, which is good enough for YouTube. Right? Then you hit next. And then it will start to save. Estimated time remaining. And it will save the video, but I don't want to save it. So I'm going to hit cancel. And then the video will show up in the folder. Whichever one you chose and then you can have a look for yourself the megabytes before and the megabytes after and you can look at the quality before and after and decide whether you like it or not um, I got this WMV technique from YouTube itself they say WMV is the best format for Windows or for video on YouTube 
Um, if you want to get fancier than that, just let me know and I can tell you what I know. It'll probably be like this. Okay?